Welcome back to McPhee Ford. Today we'll be looking at this brand new 2022 Ford Bronco Sport Badlands. Now this particular Bronco Sport is finished in Oxford white. Again, this is the Badlands model. So it is the off-road focused Bronco Sport. So you do get improved ground clearance as well as different tires. But starting up front, we do have these full LED headlights, which is standard on Bronco Sport. Again, we do get a nice Bronco logo right in the front of the grill. And part of the Badlands model, we do get improved uh, ground clearance as well as these recovery hooks down there at the bottom. Now this particular Bronco Sport has no options at all. It is a base uh, Badlands model. And the Badlands does have these uh, 17 inch sort of gray painted wheels. It's on a 225-65 Pirelli Scorpion ATR tire. You can option a more all-terrain tire if you would like. There's your Badlands logo right there on the side. Now all Bronco Sport models do come with a roof rail system which makes it easy to uh, mount, you know, a bike or a kayak or something like that. We do have these partial LED taillights here. There's your reverse camera down there with the little washer jet right there as well. Again, we got a nice Bronco Sport logo right in the back of the tailgate there. Now stepping inside of this Bronco Sport, you do get an intelligent access door handle, as well as a door entry keypad right there. So this particular Bronco Sport has not actually been through a detail shop, so there is still a little bit of, it's a little dirty inside. Um, but we do get a nice Bronco sill plate there. And starting here on the door panel, we do start to see some of the differences with the Badlands model. Uh, so we do get that active orange trim around the, uh, the door surround here. And we do have our power window controls, they're all uh, one touch automatic. Those are your power mirrors and your power locks right there. Nice soft touch material here on the armrest. And again, unique to the Badlands model, we do get these uh, sort of uh, cloth seats here with the uh, active orange accents. We get the orange stitching, as well as a little piece of uh, leather up there. Again, we got a nice Bronco logo right in the backrest as well. And until you left the steering wheel, you have your automatic color controls with your fog lights right there in the middle, as well as your tailgate release. Now we'll show you the key to this specific Bronco. This comes standard across uh, the Broncos uh, Badlands, but we do have remote start as well as the tailgate release there on the key. And push button start. Now starting here on this uh, leather wrap steering wheel, you can get a heated steering wheel, although this is the base, uh, the, this doesn't have any options on this Badlands. Uh, so it's not heated, um, but you can option in that if you would like. Um, but we have the, uh, Controls for our cruise control, as well as your volume, and controls for your center gauge cluster screen, as well as some of your phone and track settings there. Again, we got a nice Bronco logo right in the middle there. But we can scroll through some of the settings in this gauge cluster. We do have the, we can go through our audio. We can also go through our phone settings. Oh, we have our phone settings, as well as other various settings in there. Or we can go to the trip information. We have trips one and two. We also have tire pressures. We also have your audio again there. And moving here to the middle, we do have the Ford Sync. It's a Sync 4 system. It's an eight inch touchscreen display. Now we have our home uh, setting here. So we can have our radio as well as our phone right there. Or we can go into audio. We can change our sources. We do have Sirius XM radio. We can add a Bluetooth phone. We also have various apps like Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. And other various settings in here as well. I know it's a little hard to see with the uh, screen protector, but I do want to leave that on. Uh, but we have the Ford Pass Connect right there, so we can remote start, as well as lock and unlock uh, your Bronco Sport or any new Ford vehicle from anywhere in the world from your phone. We also have other general settings in there as well. 
Now we do have a manual button for the cameras. So we can push that and uh, activate the, uh, the front camera as well as a panoramic view. Now this is certainly helpful when you're off-road. And moving down, we do have the standard uh, single zone. But it's automatic. We have an automatic climate control. Again, with our heated seat button right there. We have a couple of chargers down here as well as a 12 volt. And you can option in a wireless charger. Again, this Bronco Sport uh, doesn't have that. We are missing that uh, convenience uh, premium package for the Badlands model. Um, but we do have the 8-speed automatic transmission. Uh, this has the 2-liter EcoBoost. Again, it's something else that makes the Badlands uh, different from the regular Bronco Sport models is that the Badlands does get the bigger 2-liter engine. That uh, makes about 250 horsepower. So, uh, yeah, the, uh, the regular ones come with a 1.5-liter. But they all have the 8-speed automatic. We have electronic parking brakes. So it was the auto hold feature there. There's a couple differences here from the Badlands model. We do have the trail control system, which is basically an off-road cruise control. It allows you to uh, drive at like slower speeds while focusing on uh, just the steering, and the Bronco Sport will take care of the uh, the, uh, the speed. You also have the four-wheel drive lock, as well as your traction control and your rear locking differential. Again, the rear locking differential and the four-wheel drive lock is unique to the Badlands model. And we also have a GOAT mode select, which is basically a drive mode select. We can go into here, change different drive modes. We have normal, we also have eco, sport mode, slippery, mud and ruts, sand, and also rock crawl. So these are all different modes. The rock crawl is unique to the, uh, to the Badlands Bronco Sport. And again, we got a nice center console here with some more various chargers and USBs. And this one, again, doesn't have a sunroof. But again, you can option in a sunroof if you would like. But we do get that nice active orange trim around the, uh, the screen here, as well as, again, on the door and up on the dash as well. Now stepping into the back seat of this Bronco Sport. Again, we get that nice active orange uh, you know, accent stitching, as well as, again, up on the top of the, uh, top of the back of the seat there. We get lots of space back here. And something that makes the Badlands model different from the regular Bronco Sports is it does have a rubber floor. So it does make it easier to clean up. Um, all Bronco Sport Badlands models do have the rubber floor. And again, we get that nice active orange trim here on the door with our power window switch. They're again, one touch automatic as well. We also have a 110 volt outlet down here as well as the various USB and USB-A ports down there. You've got a set of carpet mats, as well as your rear climate vents, as well as a nice fold-down center console with some cup holders. And move around to the back. But something unique to the Bronco Sport is that it actually, the tailgate is a split tailgate, so we can actually click, we have glass, as well as doors, we can click glass, and the glass does flip up separately from the rest of the tailgate, so you can access your cargo area without having to open up the entire section of the trunk. Or we can open up like just like a regular regular SUV. Maybe we do have a nice uh, rubber floor here with our rubberized seat backs waiting to be put on. We get a uh, full size spare on a uh, steel wheel. We get a nice 12 volt back here. So there's another 110 volt uh, outlet back here as well. We also do get some lights on the back of the tailgate so we can turn these on and off there's also one here as well and you can adjust the angle so it lights up uh, the area around your bronco sport but unfortunately this particular bronco sport is a sold unit but if you're interested in getting one just like this feel free to give us a call or visit mcfee4.com thanks for watching we'll see you next video